Bead heads are a common addition in many nymph patterns. When working with them, it's important to note that there is a narrow opening and that there is a slightly wider opening. The narrow opening we refer to as the front because in the vast majority of patterns, it's going to be the opening that goes over the point of the hook first. So as we slide that over the hook point, that's going to slide down and the narrow opening stops it at the eye of the hook leaving enough room for you to actually get the tip it in. If you flip that around and that goes to the eye of the hook, it's going to mostly cover it up. So that's why I refer to that as a front. One of the bigger fundamental concepts to have locked down when you work with bead heads is the sizing. And so if you look at the screen here, you're going to see a typical sizing chart. And you can pull these up on Google. This gives you an idea of what size beads should be properly matched with what size hooks. For example, this hook right here is a size 14. Typically, it's going to be matched up with a 7 64th bead. Now, there are uh, different materials for beads. There are still brass beads out there. Uh, glass beads are really common with little midge patterns. But most typically, you're going to see tungsten beads. And these come from several different manufacturers in several different colors. Uh, purples, pinks, even they're now making mottled browns and olives. More commonly, more typically, and you're going to see the gold beads or the silver or the black. I like to keep mine just in the simple sewing organizer, and as I dump them out, I just label the lids as to what size they are, and then it's really easy to scoop them out and to go ahead and use them. Tungsten is the most common because tungsten has the highest density and the highest sink rate, so that's why you most commonly see that with nymph patterns. It's going to get your pattern down quickest. So keep in mind, size them appropriately. Tungsten is going to give you the, the largest sink rate, the highest mass. Do you still have the option for glass uh, and for brass on some other patterns? Make sure that that narrow opening is on the front so that you leave yourself room to thread your tippet when you get out on the water.